I bring to you warm greetings of Yahweh from the Marshall Islands. It is regretful that I cannot join you for the Women Political Leaders Summit 2019 in Tokyo, Japan, especially since this is the first summit in East Asia Pacific region. Nevertheless, I fully support the WPL mission of raising both the numbers and influence of women in political leadership positions. I would like to pay special recognition to the many women leaders, many of whom are in the audience today, for their endless dedication, commitment, passion, and sacrifices. As women leaders, we must continue to push forward because we are also leaders of a marginalized segment of society. That is why this past March, I convened the inaugural Pacific Women Leaders Coalition Conference. The Pacific Women Leaders Coalition explored options to advance gender equality and the empowerment of women and girls. By empowering women and girls, we are increasing the chances to have more women leaders and for their voices to be heard in the highest decision-making area. As current women leaders, let us continue the momentum of breaking barriers. There are no gender limits to leadership, and it is up to us to convince future generation of girls of that. I am confident that the summit will be a success, particularly as it leads the G20 summit. As you dialogue on necessary actions in relation to the SDGs, be mindful of the fact that you are also speaking to all women, wherever they may be, who must be empowered so as to take on other leadership positions within their communities. Komol Tada, thank you once again. <laughs>